So today we're partnering with the Gnarly Bistro and uh, we're cooking with the kids and we're going to serve the primary division lunch today. Today they're making a great cheese sandwich with uh, different, uh, I think, mushrooms and turkey pepperoni and cheese and they're making fresh fruit skewers that they made with a homemade yogurt dip. So how many more of are here? Uh, how difficult sure. was it? Um, Teaching kids how to cook. And there's four uh, no, there. not very hard actually. These kids were very enthusiastic, so it always helps. And uh, you know, if you make it fun, they, they want to learn. It's just like anything they do. So uh, today's menu, we try to keep it light and fun. Things they understood, uh, things they can get their hands in and play with. And uh, I think it turned out well. I think it's something that they fun. can make at home, I guess. And that was the other part of this uh, project was uh, give them ideas that they can go home and and make. Uh, maybe they don't make the exact uh, sandwich, but they have an idea now. They can make grilled cheeses with other items other than just cheese. How is it? Good. How's the sandwich? It's good. Oh, it's so important to learn how to cook and be comfortable in the kitchen so that you have a life skill to be able to eat healthy for the rest of your life. Um, it helps them with numeracy and literacy in school. Um, and again, just being comfortable in the kitchen helps them to learn all those basic skills so that as they grow up, they are comfortable making healthy food. Especially with uh, today's food on the market, um, the more they understand about food, uh, the better, healthier choices they can make. There's um, lots of different things that they can do, whether it's measuring ingredients, stirring, um, helping take care of putting things in the garbage, washing their hands, lots of different things throughout the kitchen. And as they get older, getting comfortable with knives, learning how to use the basic stove, etc. And all of these things help them to also, um, they're more likely to try things that they make. So. When they do, uh, when they are involved in food prep, they're more likely to try foods that maybe they haven't tried before. Um, again, helping them to eat healthier in the long run. Why are we getting pictures?